Reckless driving continues to be a problem across the Milwaukee area. West Dallas leaders unveiled a plan to combat it. Taylor Lumpkin explains what drivers can expect over the coming months. Well, drivers can expect a number of things, including increased police presence and harsher penalties if they're caught driving recklessly. And this is just the beginning of what the city has in store. Reckless driving is occurring in every part of our city. It's gotten progressively worse over the past several years. It's a problem that West Dallas Police Chief Patrick Mitchell says residents are frustrated with. Drivers speeding down streets of the city, running red lights, ignoring stop signs, and more. In 2018, we would have had about 300 complaints of reckless driving in a calendar year. Fast forward to 2021. We're already at 650. Complaints that pressured officials to not only listen to those concerns, but act on them, which led the city to launch its very own reckless driving deterrence campaign. The reason reckless driving is so uh, much of a challenge right now in this area is because there aren't a lot of tools to handle it. The initiative, which was approved as part of the city's 2022 budget, will include a number of different approaches to curb reckless driving, including harsher penalties and launching a pilot program to install cameras at various intersections. They're not red light cameras, they're just higher definition cameras that can see license plates, see makes and models. Police say they'll also be putting a special emphasis on speeding and reckless driving violations. A reckless driving ticket can be a max of $200, but if we utilize this NOV, this negligent operation of a vehicle, that means the fine can be up to $10,000. Officials add that this campaign is critical in order to keep everyone safe. We're trying to be a good place to live and raise a family, and reckless driving has really been putting a damper on that. Officials are also looking at the possibility of using people's dash cam videos in order to help crack down on reckless driving as well. Reporting in West Dallas, Taylor Lumpkin, TMJ4 News.